to demonstrate a collision between an object and a mass of lighter weight, and then an object with a mass of heavier weight. So first, let's take a look at the lighter weight pole. Okay, so to discuss what we did, we took an object, being the baseball bat, and we uh, compared it to, and we applied the same force to each ball. The first ball was hit was a really light wiffle ball. The second ball that was hit was a wiffle ball that was about four times heavier than the first one. So after we hit the first one, we took a look at the distance that it traveled, and then we hit the second one, and we took it to, and we looked at the distance that it traveled, perhaps about half times as far as the lighter one. The reason for this is because, according to the definition of impulse, which is um, the force times the amount of time that it takes an object to collide with the other object, and then we look at also the impulse and the momentum theorem, which states that the force is equal to the mass, the final mass, or the, the mass times the final velocity minus the mass times the initial velocity. If we do this and we compare them with both objects, then it's clear that the mass of the heavier object will travel further because it's going to have a greater force applied to it. And that's what we demonstrated in the collision experiment between the bat and the ball of light mass and the bat and the ball of the heavy.